everyone, today I have got the top 5 bass amps from 2019, so let's get started. Here is our little amp tower. As you can see, it goes to the more compact way. There are smaller than we're used to, so you can carry them easily around. At the very end, we are going to compare them with the same lick. Let's start with the EBS. So, let's go. This was the EBS Readmar 502. It has 500 watts and can handle 2 ohm load, which is crazy for this size. So I really enjoyed playing uh, with this amp and I really like the sound. The next one is from Mark Bus. It's the little Mark Vintage. What is really unusual for Mark Bus is the tube. You can also see the tube if you have a closer look. Let's see how it sounds. Let's go on to something really heavy, something for my metal friends. It's a dark glass. It's the Alpha Omega 900 and it sounds like this. is a Phil Jones amp. You may know Phil Jones from the small practice amps and this philosophy is still here and um, we've got an amp with an aux in so when you want to practice for example with a backing track you just plug it in it's, it's super cool just in case if you want to go to a big show and want to plug it into a cab it has 800 watt so it's pretty cool. <laughs> Last but not least, we have got the TC Electronic. It's really cute and small, really cool to just put it into your bag. It's called BAM 200 and it sounds like this. I'm going to play a lick and um, I'm not going to change the settings on my bass and we are going through all the amps. At the end, I want to know which of these amps was your favorite. If you want to know more specs, you can go to the website. We've got a link down below. If you want to see more videos like that, we have some other top five videos like top five basses this year or top five effect pedals. Just check out our channel. If you haven't so far, be sure to ring the bell or hit the subscribe button. And yes, I hope to see you soon. Wish you a pleasant day. Goodbye.